Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti. I am MrPhotographer.com. In this video, we're going to continue our look at some of the new features that are found in the latest version of Photoshop. That's version 22, also known as Photoshop 2021. Now in the past, I did a couple videos already talking about some of the new features. One video was on the new sky replacement feature. Another video was on the new neural filters that are found in Photoshop 2021. If you haven't seen those videos, I'll have links to them in the description below this video. Now in this video, we're going to talk about the new hair selection technology that is found in this version of Photoshop. You're going to find that it really works great. Now one thing I want to talk about just at the beginning is all too often I get emails from people and they'll have a photograph of someone like at a backyard barbecue with a real busy background and they want to clip the person out of that scene and put them in another scene. That's still very difficult to do no matter how, you know, how much Adobe updated the technology in this version of Photoshop. It's still difficult to do. Most photographers plan ahead knowing they're going to be creating a composite and they'll photograph their model in front of either a white or gray background. That makes the clip outs a lot easier. Now with this new hair selection technology, it makes it super easy. Really, usually just a few clicks and you're done. And I'll show you on this image here. Now what you want to do is pick any one of three selection tools. If we go over here on the left hand side, you can see there's a little cubby of selection tools. Object, Quick, and Magic Wand. Those are the three selection tools. It doesn't matter which one you pick, just pick any one of those three. Because when you do that at the top, you'll have select subject. So click on that and you'll get a selection of your subject. So that was in previous versions of Photoshop, nothing new there. Now what we want to do is go to select and mask. And when you do that, you'll see the selection. And you can see that it selected pretty well. It, it got most of her hair, but it's not perfect. Well, what's new in this version of Photoshop is, is this button right here, Refine Hair. Click on that and you'll see that it grabbed more of the strands of hair. Now all you need to do is go over here on the right hand side and click on Decontaminate Colors. That will improve it even further and then you're done. Click OK and you'll see that now it's really a perfect selection. I could drop her into another scene and it looks natural. Most of the hairs are there. Looks pretty good. Now I'm going to show you another example. There, those of you that aren't familiar with doing this, you may be unfamiliar with some of the other tools. And I just want to show you something you may run into. So I have this image here. You can see her hair is nice. Everything looks nice. We'll do the same thing. Any selection tool, I'll stay with that quick selection brush. We'll go to select subject gets a selection, we'll go to select and mask. Now you can see it didn't uh, do too well around her hair. So I'll go to refine hair and it improved. But when you look at it now, look at her fingers. You see it's missing a piece of her finger on her left hand. It also kind of around the edges there, it didn't select very well. Well, this has been in Photoshop for a long time and that is a refine edge brush. So what you need to do is go over here on the left hand side and you see these different tools over here. The second from the top is Refine Edge Tool. The keyboard shortcut is R. We're going to take that. And we're simply going to brush on the areas we want to bring back in. In this case, her finger. And then we're going to go around the edges, like there where it didn't really get between her fingers very well. And over here. And then over here. And then over here around these fingers. Get a better selection down in there a little bit. And that looks pretty good. So uh, maybe just a little bit right there too. And if any of her hair was like that, you could do that as well around her hair. But in this case, the new Refine Hair tool that uh, is in this version of Photoshop did a great job. So again, we're just going to click on Decontaminate Colors. You can see it improved the hair selection a lot more. And we'll click on OK. And you can see there we have a perfect selection. Now we could drop her into another scene and it will look natural. So that's the new uh, hair selection technology that's found in this version of Photoshop, Photoshop 2021. Again, I did a couple videos already on some of the new things in Photoshop. I'll have those linked in the description below this video. Check those out. I'd like to thank everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. 
I'll talk to you guys soon. <laughs>